Hey, what is up heroes and welcome back to some more Pokemon Ranger. Last episode, we attempted the four challenges. Well, we didn't want to do three because if you do the fourth one, then it's a, a great calamity happens and we, we don't want that. So we beat a Flygon, we beat a Salamence that was super hard, and we beat a Kingdra, or two Kingdra, and uh, beat Charizard, and want to beat Charizard. As you can see, um, Big Earthquake and Lava Heads appeared everywhere. It's unbelievable. Everything's completely changed in here. There's lava where water flowed. The tremor and the roaring noise were from the eruption of an underground volcano. Oh. Aria. Oh. So you're safe after all. I was about to leave at Summerland after a mission when the earthquake hit. Got a feeling that this was no ordinary quake. I thought maybe, just maybe, something unthinkable happened. I'm hoping it didn't happen, but you didn't clear the fourth challenge, did you? Aria, we are... Uh, the fourth challenge, um... We did it, but there's a good reason. We can explain. There's a Charizard in pain. Oh. Save your excuses for later. What is that over there? Is that an Entei? Okay. I thought this episode will be trying to capture an Entei. An Entei? Why would a legendary Pokemon appear here? I don't know why, but it must be linked somehow to the volcanic eruption. Anyways, I can't let you handle this anymore. I can't believe you would clear the fourth challenge. No ranger would be so foolish to do such a thing. I'll calm the Entei. That'll stop the disaster from getting any worse. You can do whatever you want, but don't do anything to mess things up anymore. Understood? Understood. We caused this. We have to do something about it. Alright, let's see if we can go after Entei as well. Ooh, a Nummel. Might as well get this bad boy. Add it to the glossary. Ow. And easy. I thought we got to be close to level, well, the next level. That's level 27, but <laughs> uh, I don't know how the levels work in this game at the moment. Right, so let's go get this electrite because it can heal us up if we take a little bit too much damage. If we've got to get end here in a bit, then we're going to need as much recovery Pokemon as we can get. Because end is probably going to destroy us. Right, so how much XP do we need? Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, 496. Not bad. I feel like we can get in there if we find the right Pokemon. Uh, let's see. Something that can smash two rocks. Oh. Got the Go Rock Squad. Hold it right there, you calamity causing criminals. Oh. Well, he ain't wrong, to be honest. <laughs> right, Slugman Makago, we got this. Ow. This is actually kind of annoying. How are you supposed to... Okay, I'm going to have to um, slow him down a little bit. Okay, that makes things a little bit easier. Now just in the cargo. Just got a really big circles because the trail of lava. 119 XP! Whew. Oh, that's nice. See you guys. This just isn't my day. Earlier, some snooty ranger girl knocked me aside when I tried to stop her. She didn't bat an eye and just kept going. I feel like such a loser. <laughs> Alright, and ooh. Oh, I need two water moves. Oh, it's gonna move. Because they look like a graveler. Alright, wait long enough and it uh, moves itself. Oh no, I almost had it. So if this has the two rock smash, we can break the boulder and see what's in there. Maybe get a new Pokemon that can help us out a little bit. So we're gonna have to, yes, yeah, stock up on some water type Pokemon to really help with Entei. Alright, so if we go back up here. Graveler can knock this down. Thank you very much. Ooh. Oh, a Sceptile? Yeah, man! Uh... No. Ow. Gotcha. Whew. Trainer 
triple slice. Nice. Alright, don't really need the tango. I can leave that. If we need, we can always come back. We know where it is. I'm gonna actually heal up a little bit as well because it's taking quite a bit of damage. Doesn't fully restore us, but. And the 5 extra HP is super nice. Alright, so we beat this dude here. We got the graveler. Now we want to go this way, I'm assuming. God, and then what is a magma up there? Can we get that magma? I think we... No, we can't. I think we have to go through here first. Oh, no, a graveler. Got triple slugma, okay. Hey, I thought I recognised you. You remember me, don't you? You don't remember? You really don't remember? Ah, I'm not taking that. <laughs> Alright, go straight for a minimum. Paralyze all three, get all three at once. Hoping. Stay together, stay together, that'll do. No! Whew. That was close. We should grow a level. Have we grown a level yet? How much XP do we need? We've got to be so close, surely. I remember you way more than I ever want to. <laughs> I feel bad for taking that guy's Pokemon. But don't you remember me yelling, God, don't ever forget this? Well, this time, don't you forget it. God, don't ever forget this. I'm going to forget it, 100%. Right, so how close are we to growing a level? We need 16 XP. So next Pokemon we find, Gumanetric. Be great to heal us up as well. We should grow a level. Easy. Twelve, oh, 12 XP, seriously? Can't even give us an like, extra 4 XP. That's mean. Oh. I won't let you uh, ruin the boss's dreams. He's trying to create a different kind of ranger. It's probably for the good of the people in society. So, if that guy was blocking the stairs, we should go check the stairs out. Because this is a different way than what the guy was blocking, so... Things are so fast. Oh, stop jumping! You know what? Slow you down a little bit. Go for the sneasel. What? Oh, there you go. Now we grow a level. Got 27 energy. And line increased. Oh, come on. Whew, that Meowth was kind of annoying. I would have thought Meowth would be a lot tougher than a Sneasel. I said it's for the good of people in society earlier, but I think it's also for pride and for money too. Our boss is human too. <laughs> Alright, so I think the boss is up there, but let's go this way first. And they were blocking the stairs, so let's go up here and see what we can find. So I think we might not find any water Pokemon around here. Oh, a Hound- oh! Okay. Need a triple uh, Rock Smash to get through there. But if we do, we can get a Houndoom. Not too sure we're going to find that bad boy, but let's look around. So I can get it, I'll get it. If not, no worries. Oh, Rhydon's surely got to be a triple rock smash. This is probably the way to go, to be fair. Ah, so easy. You the triple rock smash we're looking for? Yes, you are. And this... Yeah, the, the way we're about to go was the right way to go anyway. You just have to come up here to get the Rhydon to get through. Oh, man, I thought I was going to find like some really cool, powerful Pokemon, but... I was wrong. I'm going to avoid these dudes just because we don't need to fight them. And then Slugma has uh, a different opinion on that. <laughs> nice and easy. Go on, right on. Smash it. Do you want to battle that Houndoom? 
Come here, Houndoom. Oh no, we won off. Gotcha. Keep doing that, just stopping one before. We got Dark Pokey Assist now, which is good. I think the Mag oh, Magma was around here, wasn't it? So we'll get that bad boy. Get a nice little bot face. Come on, boy. Two fires? Well that's 70 XP, because if that was, that's pretty good. Yeah, 70 XP, nice. How much XP do we need to grow level now? We need... 1,000... Ah, 723 more. Are you still here? I'm telling you this as a senior. Watch out for the Go Rock Squad guy already. He's all about the grunts you run into on the way here. The Pokemon he uses is incredibly strong. I desperately did my best to try to capture it, but it wrecked my Styler. I feel so angry and useless. Uh oh. That tremor. Something happened in there. Okay. You two. You don't have the time to be stunned. Isn't it your job as rangers to investigate and resolve crises? I hate admitting this, but with my Styler broken, I can't do my job. As an experienced as you are, I have no choice but to pin my hopes on you. Alright, sounds good. We just quickly save the game, just in case we, um, you know, get a bit wrecked, which is always, always a possibility. <laughs> right, and we're saved, and I want to check to the left as well, just in case we can, there you go, get some decent Pokemon to help us out. Uh, I'm going to get him in a second, just want to check what we can find. Wait, we need a Charmander. Never had a Charmander before. the glossary and we want to go back down and get another Minetric because it will help us get healed up if we need it. Uh, keep Sceptile because it could be good. Got Houndoom and that's a dead end. I'll get the um, the Graveler as well. Gotcha, just about. 60 XP, good. Uh, nope, don't need you. We do want the Minetric. Nope, oh no. Just taking six damage, not good. I mean, we'll get an extra back, so it's, fi it's fine. Sucks we lost some HP against that, but we need him. these two and then we'll get the Graveler as well. Make sure there's nothing down there, it's dead end. Come on Graveler. There you go. Gotcha. Now it's time to get Entei. Well, I'm assuming it's actually not going to be Entei yet. Yeah, got to probably battle that dude. Got the, uh, the Gorok squad. So we battled the girl with the violin. We still need to battle the girl. I think the, it's either a guitar or a bass guitar. And one maybe has like a guitar or a guitar, I don't know. And then one definitely has like the bongo. Nice little drum. Ah, oh, it's you. Say so, hey! It's not the calamity causing combo. I like your alliteration there. But Calam calamity causing combo kind of lacks that street sensibility thing. Calamity creating combo? Who cares about that? Anyways, I have to hand it to you two. Our boss is mighty pleased. Yes, sir. Tremendously pleased with you. You played a huge part in the testing of our latest Styler. Now your part is done. If we let you scurry around anymore, you'll get into the boss's foot. Uh, why are you giving me that eye? I'll show you. Okay. So what Pokemon do you have? Time to work. Slacking. KO these clowns. Let's get ourselves a bonus from the boss. Or oh, slacking. Oh, that looks so weird. Oh, I don't like that. It's so weird seeing it on his feet. 
It's oh man. Usually Sack Sacken just laying down, aren't they? Ah, oh, it's so weird. Alright, let's try and get this. Got it. First try. Like 200 XP as well, 210 XP. Woo. There you go, that's more like it. Slacking just laying down. Easy. Well, so much for that bonus pay. That's alright, I stalled you a bit. I did my job. Our boss is in the back. While you guys were fumbling around, the experiment finished already. That tremor a little uh, earlier is proof. You're too late to stop it. <laughs> bye bye. See ya. Doesn't mean we still can't have a look. See what's going on. Oh, the music. There's Ente. Is that the Go Rock Squad's boss? And of course, it's Gordon. I told you it'd be him. You are. Oh, yes, I remember now. You're my guide from the Lyra Forest. Faultsy, wasn't it? <laughs> you seem surprised. At the time, I certainly wasn't much more than a pitiful old man lost in the woods. But now, I would think the most pitiful people in Fjord would be you two. As the boss of the Gorok Squad, I, Gordor, will explain this, or explain how this came to be. Consider it a thanks for your help. The legend of the uh, jungle relic turned out to be true. Thanks to a pair of gullible do-gooders, the fourth and final challenge was cleared. As a result, the underground volcano erupted, and the Entei was awakened. The Entei, overburdened with fiery energy, appeared to become the first capture of my new styler. Being a legendary Pokemon, it put up a terrific fight, but in the end, my experiment became a smashing success. The loud noise and tremor from earlier were the result of that capture. Oh. That conclusively proves that the Go Rock Squad is an organization that surpasses the Ranger Union. It won't be long before we, and not you, are considered legitimate Rangers. Let me assign you your final job as a Ranger. If nothing is done with that Entei, its presence is certain to trigger another eruption of the underground volcano. That will not only destroy this relic, it will devastate, devastate the natural environment and ruin people's lives in Fior. Now wouldn't that be a terrible shame? So, let me assign you this mission, which will also mark your retirement. This is your assignment. Do whatever you want, because I don't care. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's go, man. Gotta try and capture an Entei. Right, um... How many lines have we got? Oh, wow, you can summon more Pokemon. That's not cool. Right, come on. No! Just gonna go for mine and now. No! Oh no, I should've just got the, ma uh, the magma. Uh... Ah, come on. No, I didn't mean to... Go out the way, Entei. What did I not get the magma? Oh, I can't see him because he's too far up. Right, wait a sec. Now... Just want to get the magma. Get him out of the way and then we can go for Entei. Okay, now we got to play it slow. Oh, hit me! No! Okay, gotta heal up, gotta heal up. Let's go for a Houndoom. Actually, has that is there any point in that? Eh, might as well. I'll find a power. Using five of the starters energy units double the capture line's length. Okay. Gotcha! Oh, Houndoom is so good! Oh, dude, I love Houndoom's ability. 
Lose five energy but double the length. That's just so helpful. We got Entei. See ya. Captured the Entei? I'll admit to not having expected that, but that's fine. My experiment was a complete success. Our plan has taken a giant leap forward. With my Styler, even legendary Pokemon can be captured without the need for any special skills. Though it's impossible to control the behavior of legendary Pokemon quite yet, but that should soon be a reality with only minor tweaks. I am plenty satisfied with what we've achieved today. Okay. Please convey my best regards to your Professor Hastings, the Ranger Union's Chief of Technology. Yes, be certain to give the good Professor the best regards of Gordor. Okay. That it? That was uh, pretty awesome. Houndoom, too good though. So I assume we're just going to leave this place now. Let Arya know what happened. Tremors have subsided. Did you maybe capture the Entei? You did! It's incredible! What exactly happened here? I want you to explain it from the top. Oh, there was an injured Charizard, you captured it, and that was the fourth challenge? That's awful. What a rotten thing for them to do. So, so, so that's what you went through. You should got caught up in some terrible things through no fault of your, of your own. Look, it's that Charizard. Hey, look at Charizard go! Oh, what's he doing? That was the Charizard? It seemed to be winching in pain, but it seemed to be grateful to you. Let's go back to Summerland and report to Cameron what happened. Sounds good. Alright, and I think we'll end this part right here. Next episode, we'll, uh, guess go and stop the Go Rock Squad. Thank you guys for watching, have a great day. Peace.